Hello. All right. Every day <laughs> there is a national day for something, whether it's coffee day, love your pet day, margarita day. Maybe you missed that one. Today, though, is National Chili Day. Okay, guys, I don't know if you know this, but chili can be very competitive. I mm. should know. Ginger, Lisa, and I have done a few chili cook-offs among ourselves. It's always very contentious. But there is always a lot of debate over what makes a good chili. I love watching that Facebook Live you guys do. <laughs> so News 6 Insider Guide, Crystal Moyer, is here now to break down this debate. And we have... We have some things here at our desk. A lot going on. Yes. Good. Yes, we got some goodies this morning. National Chili Day is always the fourth Thursday in February. Doesn't really feel much like chilly weather here in Florida, of course. But I guess when you remember most of the rest of the country is deep in winter, makes it a little you know, make some sense there. So how did the meal become so popular in America? Seems no one really knows for sure. I found a few different theories. One is that chili goes all the way back to American frontier settlers. They put all the ingredients together form, and form bricks and dry them so they could boil the bricks for meals on the trails, huh? Another is that chili stands popped up in San Antonio in the late 1800s. That became a tourist attraction leading to the San Antonio chili stands place at the 1893 World's Fair. Pretty cool there. And we've also heard of the so-called chili queens, a group of women who sold a spicy meat stew in San Antonio out of wagons, regardless of exactly where it started. We know it has a long staple in Texas where it became the state food in 1977. Now comes the big debate. What makes the best chili? Commonly made up of tomatoes, chili peppers, meat, garlic. You can add pretty much anything to chili. Should there be beans in it? And who makes the best? It's part of the debate mm -hmm. we're going to look at with you uh -oh. ladies today. That's why you have these chili bowls okay. on your desk. Okay. So each of you have three cups in front of you. They're labeled one, two, and three. You'll okay. try each and tell me which one is your favorite. Of course, we'll do the big reveal mm. of which is which. We're and I will say one. two of them are fast food chilies okay. and one Ooh. is homemade. So Homemade mm. from who? I'm not going to tell you until oh. after. <laughs> And for those of you at home, we want you to get involved as well. We want to know what your opinions are on the chili debate. Mm. Right now, for our new six insiders on ClickOrlando.com slash insider, we have this story. It's a contest. You can win a $100 gift card and a cookbook. And we have a poll there for you. So make sure you log on. Become an insider. It is free. We'll just ask you for a name and email. And we want to know, do you like beans? No beans. Do you want cheese? No cheese. You know, we're going to solve that debate here in just a moment. Oh, so, I know. Oh, I know. Let's see. You know? Candace oh, yeah. says she knows. Oh, I know. All right. What do you know, Candace? Julie, you, you are have a little white top there. Oh, did I? Uh, uh, <laughs> say my signature mother. move is um, <laughs> to spill things all over myself. So are we announcing our picks now? Yes. Okay, I'm going with number two. Okay. Is the homemade one? What? what? She's not what? Wait, don't tell homemade. us yet. We're which, just saying oh. which one is the best. Mm. So Julie says number two. I'm what about you? Two. I go three. Three? I'm tied between one and three. One and three. Okay, we've got two. Mm hmm. Three, three, one and three. So the result is number one, you can hold up number one for me, Candace. Nope. Number one is Wendy's chili. Really? I thought number mm. three was, was chili. Wendy's. Wow. Yes. I like Wendy's chili. <laughs> Top Everyone of like likes nice, Wendy's chili. Everyone likes nice Wendy's potato. chili. Okay, number three, because you said one and three. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Number three, Firehouse Subs. Oh, what? Chili. Yeah. Wow. I didn't know they had chili. I didn't know they had it. They have was... chili. They have chili. And drum roll number two, mm -hmm. Ginger, our very own mm. anchor, Ginger Gaston. I knew it. Gaston. I knew it. <laughs> you know, I, she eats this almost every day in the green room. And as soon as I tasted it, I'm like, that's what it smells like what Ginger eats every day. Ah. <laughs> I see why she eats it every day. It's so good. Yeah. That's so funny. You I can taste the love. Oh, yes, for sure. Right? And she brought all the fixins, so I didn't want to add it in there because it would have been so obvious. But she would hate me if I did not mention she had the Fritos, she had mm -hmm. the cheese. Okay. You know, I'll say, yeah. I'll say the two. Up. Yes. <laughs> so it's I about will, the toppings. Yes, it is about the toppings. I do like my toppings. Mm -hmm. Sour cream, a little yes. bit of cheese. Sometimes you can do like a, like a white chicken chili. Like yes. you can do like all white beans mm -hmm. and some of the red ones or whatever. And vegetarian to too. Yeah. yeah. For there are no who don't want meat. You're our favorite insider guide. You know that? <laughs> I will Food feed you all. Yes. <laughs> and don't forget, we have a contest going right now on our website, clickorlando.com slash insider. You can post your chili recipe and enter in our chili recipe contest. Now, there's no votes or anything. If you post something, we will pick a random winner. You can win a $100 Publix gift card and a Rachel Ray cookbook. There is a chili recipe in there. So we will pick a winner next Thursday. All right. 
The reason why I, I didn't pick Ginger's is because I was just so used to number well, that's one. okay. She's watching from home right now. You know what? In our original chili cook-off <laughs> that Lisa okay. Ginger and I did, Lisa won. I mean, Justin Warmoth was our judge, and he said that he should have picked Ginger's. Same. He has since, I'm, like, I'm said tasting he, it again. So he has changed his vote, which They're is a very good. sensitive topic. They're but. all good. I'm glad you all yeah. survived this, <laughs> this task wins. I've Ginger given wins. you all this morning. <laughs> and don't forget to sign up to be an insider so that you can enter in these contests, especially coming towards spring break. Oh, we yeah. have a lot of contests coming up, so I'm telling you, you want to sign up as soon as possible. And who knows? Maybe Crystal will come to your house and deliver options for chili one day. I don't know if that's an option right now, but I'm <laughs> surely open to it. <laughs>